Hey guys, so this is my modified ECX temper. I had this original body on it. Um, I trimmed it at one point. So the point of this video is to show you how I've greatly um, reduced the torque twist. Um, I was playing around with a couple of ideas and I came upon one that worked very well. Uh, but before that, I'll just show you some of the upgrades that I've done because you probably don't recognize it as a ECX temper besides that frame probably um first thing i did was i changed these really cheap tires out um i got these pitbull growler all-terrain extras they've got a really nice soft compound um, i used the original beadlock rims um, but i did slightly have to carefully trim these tires that i got because they weren't quite exactly the same as these here um, so, then, I, uh, put this Toyota Tundra body on it. It's a nice body. I got it off of eBay. It's a Radio Shack Toyota Tundra. And how I built that was I built my own little aluminum frame. And I installed magnets there and there. Um, and hinges on the back, so does that. And then what I've done is I uh, took the battery and uh, this part here, I forgot what it's called, and I swapped them around. Um, then what I did is I also weighted the wheels. These rims here have full-on weights in the front. The back ones have a little bit less. And with the new tires, they came with these foams uh, and then some smaller, softer foams on the outside. Uh, I took all of these out because I had plenty of weight in here. Um, anyways, so now to the torque twist now. What I've done, let's go over here, is so all of the shocks on the bottom, they come with those little cups that hold the spring in place on the bottom of the coilover. Well, I had ordered earlier a couple of extra coilovers because I needed to replace one. I decided to pull one of those little cups off, like you see on the left side, and add it. So basically, both of my left side coil coilovers have those spring cups. And just doing that, I compressed the spring a little bit more. And it has greatly eliminated the torque twist that I had. Now, before before this body would rock to the left side so much when I'm driving and now it's pretty much not now um, of course in reverse it still rocks a little bit but I'm mostly driving forwards anyways so pretty cool oh guys I just remembered another upgrade I've done is those blue wheel spacers those aluminum ones you see um, those are 19 millimeter spacers uh, I got them all four so that made my wheel stance way wider compared to the original so I don't know if this changes my scale size I'm sure it does but yeah really happy with how this turned out thanks for watching